The Food and Drug Administration today told the makers of one of the country's most popular cold medications, Zycam, to stop selling its nasal spray and swabs. In the last 10 years, about 130 consumers have filed complaints saying they permanently lost their sense of smell after using Zycam. And its manufacturer is facing a flurry of lawsuits. Here's Lisa Stark. They are popular and heavily advertised products, promising relief from the common cold. Taken at the first sign, Zycam is clinically proven to shorten a cold. But today's FDA warning is clear. Consumers should immediately stop using Zycam cold remedy nasal gel and the nasal swabs, both adult and children size. The agency says the products may destroy a person's sense of smell temporarily or even permanently. As soon as I had used the product, um, I started to have intense burning in my nostrils. Katie Rhodes tried Zycam nasal gel just once last August. After the intense burning came an immediate loss of smell. If you can't smell, you can't taste. I couldn't enjoy food. I couldn't enjoy wine. I also, the, one of the things that I most missed was I couldn't smell my children. Why is this happening? The FDA today said the products contain a zinc compound and that zinc is known to damage the sensors in the nose linked to smell. Matrix Initiatives, the company that makes Zycam, today said it will suspend shipments of these products and will reimburse consumers. But it called the FDA's action unwarranted and insisted there is no causal link between Zycam and loss of smell. But three years ago, the company paid out $12 million to settle claims of more than 300 people who said that the products had damaged their sense of smell. The firm, though, admitted no responsibility. Katie Rhodes, who through treatment has regained some of her ability to smell, was overjoyed at the FDA's action, hoping it will spare others her pain. Lisa Stark, ABC News, Washington.